John Crowley's novel, Egypt, is a multi-layered work of literature that explores the nature of reality, the power of imagination, and the quest for meaning in life. Set in the late 1970s, the novel follows the stories of several characters who are all connected by their search for answers to life's fundamental questions. One of the most striking aspects of Egypt is its use of multiple narratives and timelines. The novel is divided into four parts, each of which focuses on a different set of characters and events. These different storylines are intertwined and connected by themes and motifs, creating a rich tapestry of ideas and experiences. At the heart of Egypt is the concept of Egypt, a mystical land that exists outside of time and space. This land is a metaphor for the realm of imagination, where ideas and symbols can take on a life of their own. The characters in the novel are all drawn to this realm, whether through their pursuit of knowledge, their artistic endeavors, or their search for spiritual enlightenment. One of the most prominent characters in the novel is Pierce Moffat, a writer and scholar who becomes obsessed with the idea of Egypt. As he delves deeper into his research, he becomes convinced that the world as we know it is a false reality, constructed by the forces of history and culture. Instead, he believes that there is another reality, a hidden reality that is waiting to be discovered. Another important character in the novel is Rosie Rasmussen, a young woman who is searching for her own identity and place in the world. She is drawn to the realm of Egypt through her fascination with tarot cards and the mystical traditions of the past. As she explores this realm, she begins to see the world in a new light, and to understand that there is more to life than what meets the eye. Throughout the novel, Crowley weaves together a complex tapestry of themes and motifs that explore the nature of reality, the power of imagination, and the quest for meaning in life. One of the most prominent of these themes is the idea of transformation. Many of the characters in the novel undergo profound changes as they journey through the realm of Egypt, shedding their old selves and embracing new identities and perspectives. Another important theme in the novel is the relationship between the past and the present. The characters in the novel are all searching for a deeper understanding of the world, and they often look to the past for answers. However, they also realize that the past is not a fixed reality, but rather a constantly evolving and changing landscape that is shaped by our perceptions and interpretations. In addition to these themes, Egypt is also a novel that explores the power of language and storytelling. The characters in the novel are all writers or scholars, and they are all engaged in the process of creating and interpreting narratives. As they explore the realm of Egypt, they begin to understand that language and storytelling have the power to shape reality, and that the stories we tell ourselves are just as important as the events that actually happen. In conclusion, Egypt is a rich and complex work of literature that explores the nature of reality, the power of imagination, and the quest for meaning in life. Through its multiple narratives and themes, the novel presents a nuanced and thought-provoking meditation on the human experience, and invites us to consider the ways in which we shape our own reality through our beliefs, our language, and our storytelling.